I'm Laura Lawson, and you are listening to the show that's all about the grape in all its glory. This is why Napa Valley remains so popular. You could walk for a half mile and hit eight wineries. Hey guys, uh, we are here in beautiful Napa, California. The very first, the making of a dental startup retreat. Uh, here with our good friends, Dr. Ashley Hobes, Michael Arias, the founders of the group. Uh, when what proves to be, what's going to be an amazing two days of CE, not your normal CE. This is gonna be an incredible experience. Friends, wine, community, come check it out. Good morning, welcome to Napa. You guys are in our playground now. This is literally three years in the making and the first speaker to kick off our inaugural retreat is the CEO and founder of Studio 88. Their team has been with me from day one, and I can't imagine a better first speaker than none other, Joshua Scott. Thank you. It's amazing to be here today to, uh, with you guys. So many awesome startups, so many awesome projects, people in this room. Uh, we're gonna have a good time today. So uh, I think this is an important conversation for this morning, for this time, for you, for now, because I think this is an amazing group. I remember when I first talked to Ashley, your first video had just gone up. You were right in front of the Smile Co. building. Um, you were crying. Um, today was the last day at my previous associateship. And as they say, when one door closes, another one opens. So we're gonna go out and take a look around. Uh, bear with me. But last week, I just closed on this beautiful building. I know it, it doesn't look like much, but this is what is gonna be my dream practice. Michael Arias had actually connected us. I remember talking to you. I, mean, I was actually in my kitchen, the, the phone rings, and I told you, I was like, it's Dr. Hobez, I'm, I gotta take this. And California is, you know, per capita, the most competitive state in the country when it comes to dentists. And so at one point she says, Josh, am I crazy for doing a startup? And, and basically what I said back to her was, Ashley, if you're gonna build the same practice that's in that town, like you're not gonna compete. If you can do something different, not only can you compete, but you can win. The inside needs a lot of love and a lot of work, but I'm just so excited to, to just get to work and, and do dentistry on my terms and, and treat patients and my team the way I want to be treated. And I am just so excited to document the making of my dreams because it's been something that I've dreamt about for so long. And I'm going to be documenting everything because this is my dream and and for anyone else who wants to aspire to be something or do something, just do it. You know, don't let fear hold you back. So. I'm bringing this up this weekend because I know this is all you too. No matter what I face, there are two voices um, that are in my head and I've, I've learned to identify them. The first one that always talks to me is it's it's yelling, it's aggressive, it's loud. It feels, some of it feels like it's a megaphone. Um, it tells me I am not enough. I've also learned over that time there's another voice that speaks to me and it's quiet, it's soft, it's like it doesn't demand attention and that voice says, if not you, then who? What you're doing is significant. Your story is worth it. It's worth chasing, it's worth fighting for, it's worth going after. I know every day that you're probably dealing with these two voices and one of them is like, what makes you think? Dot, 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 fill in the blank. There's another voice that says, if not you, then who? And that's why you did this. And you listen to that voice, you follow that voice, because your story is worth it. Guys, I, uh, I had an absolute blast being here. Thank you so much. Um, Ashley, thank you. Uh, this is amazing. I enjoyed my time. Uh, my pleasure being here. Thank you so much. There's a waterfall in here. Guys, Dr. Zanita Hamlin here. How are you? Good, how yeah, are you? Good, what did you think of the first day? <laughs> Fantastic, yeah. phenomenal. Yeah, what was your favorite part? I mean the wine tasting. Oh, you're supposed oh, to no. say my oh, presentation. Sorry. Oh my god! Come on. For his 
you're jerking. And I don't cry. Yeah. I think the only time I cried was maybe like after childbirth and then this guy started watering a little bit. So I did? The, yeah, after yeah. hearing your story, oh, yeah, yeah, I was yeah. like, my gosh, I'm starting to, my eyes got a little sweaty. Yeah, yeah. So, but the wine tasting was your favorite part. It was fun. There's that. It was different. I mean, you don't go to any conference and go wine tasting. I know, so I know. There's that. I know. He did really good. He did really good. <laughs> what was the highlight for you? Oh gosh. It's just surreal to see everybody come together for like our conference. Yeah. And apparently next year um, it's going to be in Miami. Oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> a little, little uh, secret information here. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah okay. You didn't hear that from us yeah. though. <laughs> no, awesome. Uh, I just want to like let you know how proud I am of you. I know you don't need that, but like I'm so proud oh, of no, you. Oh no, I need all the words of affirmation. <laughs> <laughs> Building a business and trying and all the ideas and trying to launch them. And um, so you did it. Thank you. This is awesome. My highlight for the event is every little detail and absolutely the attendees. The speakers have been amazing. They're super inspiring. You get connected, you get to meet people, you get to have the exposure, and you truly get to rub shoulders with people who have been there, done that, and done it very successfully. A lot of the magic really happens afterwards. Like last night, hanging around the fire on the rooftop. It's not often that you get to be in an intimate atmosphere like Napa, breaking bread with each other and talking about things for two days long. I think this is gonna be the first of many more events to come. This is really surreal to be here on a rooftop in wine country with 76 of my closest friends. Woo! Yes. We love you, Ashley. I love you so much. I'm so thankful that you are all here. I know you have traveled from near and far and it really, it just makes my heart like sing and it just fills me up. And that is exactly my why. All right, guys, well, look, that's a wrap on the first making of retreat. Amazing experience. I mean, from great speakers in the morning and the first half of the day to uh, unique vineyard experiences and wine tasting topped off every evening with a group dinner. They're over there enjoying dinner. I'm on the rooftop here. I mean, what other CE event has this type of thing? And so it's just been an amazing experience, amazing friends. Guys, put it on your calendar for 2023. It's going to be a great, amazing experience.